All right, so those of you guys have watched one of my last videos. I don't know if it was the actual last one or if I put stuff in between, but the spot's gonna look familiar. Uh, this, there's a bluff under here that comes out, like a rock bluff, and I'm hoping to catch the fish as they come out and around it. Uh, it's early morning, as you probably can tell, and I think they're gonna start moving as that sun comes up chasing bait. Last time it worked out pretty good here, uh, which was only like three days ago. So I'm hoping conditions are gonna be very similar. The flow rate's very similar. All that, well, what they're calling for is similar. It, it's uh, supposed to be 37,000 cubic feet, but it doesn't look like it's flowing a whole lot. But we're gonna give it a shot here. Let's see if we can catch a monster. I'm using frozen shad, not my favorite, but definitely not the worst. So we'll see what happens here. Uh, I'm hoping for another day like uh, Thursday. It's Sunday now. Um, so maybe it's four days. But uh, it was pretty good on, on Thursday. We'll see. Hey, we've got a slow takedown here, like flathead takedown. Okay, we got a blue. We got a blue finally. I've been waiting out this spot. It's been really slow. I've been here for about a half hour now. And this is the first real bite. I've had a couple nibbles, but that was it. This guy's not bad feeling. Yeah, I really wish it was flowing like it was claiming it was gonna flow. Maybe the maybe there's incoming tide, it's kind of screwing it up. I don't know, but yeah, there's not much current and I was really, really expecting more. That's all right. I weighed out the fish. Oh, he's way up out there. What's he doing? He's really not that big. You see him? He's like a freaking dolphin. Come here. Now, here he comes. He's fighting above his weight class. Man, he dove right towards the boat here. That helps. He might even be a giant channel. He looked really dark. Hey, that outside rod. Something little wants to take it. Hey, 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 that one's more, that one's real. That one's real. That's a real fish. <sighs> Maybe the, the drag's kind of loose on it, but this one's definitely bigger. Sorry, fish, you're going to have to wait. This one's bigger. All right, went from nothing to some action here. Maybe, maybe the flow's just slight, slightly picking up or something. All right, well, this one's... This one's closer. Why don't you just get him in? He's gonna be in the way. Why do I always fish alone? <laughs> yeah, it's a blue. Okay, I was thinking he was a, a channel when I first saw him, but he's way too big for the channel. Hey, that's an angry fish back there, guys. Ah. Uh, I think I'm just gonna flip this guy. Uh, grab him. Gotta, I wanna save my fish for that other one, or my net for that other fish. He's, he's still on, right? Yeah, oh yeah, he's still on. All right, I love this problem. Hey, you guys wanna see on this camera? Here you go. guy I think is a little bit bigger than the one on the boat. They're both decent fish though. Cool. Yeah, this one's probably pushing 20 if I had to guess. Doubt, doubt he's actually 20, but probably close to it. I don't know, he's hunkering down now. He might be a 20, might be bigger. Look at that. <laughs> it's giving up a little bit now. It's coming up. Or not. All right, this is the fight I like. This is why you catfish right here. You got to enjoy that fight. I mean, if not, why are you fishing? 
All right. Yeah, that's a, just not super long, just stocky, thick. All right, that's a that's a good double. <laughs> yeah, thing's got some shoulders on it. All right, it's still pretty cold. I'm gonna get my gloves on. All right, so here's the hero shot. Nice double. <laughs> uh, I put this little older guy back here. I didn't weigh him, but he's probably like 16 or 17. This one, however, is 23 pounds. 23 and a half if you really want to get crazy. <laughs> he's so cold. That's a good fish. I like it. Let's get a couple more of these today. I think they're going to make me work for it though. Over here. I go. Swimming upside down. So he wanted an aquarium catfish. But he right himself, took off. Yeah, that's a solid start to the day. Like I said, it took a little bit of time to get those first bites, but then bam, a double just like that. That's awesome. I'm going to fish this a little bit longer. I was actually thinking about moving already. I'm glad I didn't. All right, I know I said I was gonna fish that other spot for a while, and there's a good chance I'm gonna go back to it, but I had a little freak out where I thought I left my phone or I signed the, uh, or paid for my launch permit today. Thought it was sitting on the drop box still. So I went back, looked for it, couldn't find it, and turns out it was just sitting in my boat. But uh, I decided to try out a different spot that I've tried before. Works for, I've, I've had some good luck. Uh, so this is an island and uh, it's real shallow there and it drops off pretty quick right over here and it's kind of muddy over that way. So hindsight after I cast it, I probably should have put some of my float rigs over there to keep them out of the mud. But let's see, I'm gonna see, uh, hopefully like you know, one side or the other shows me which uh, where the fish are at. They could be in the deep, they could be on the ledge or they could be in the shallow. Well, I was taking a leak, and then this this one started going. It doesn't look all that hateful. It doesn't look all that bad, guys. Feels kind of nice, too. Definitely a blue cat here. Not feeling much head action or, like, shaking or anything. It's just, right now, it's just weight. It's kind of strange. Give you a chance, dude. It's also in 40 some foot of water. Ooh, there's something big under the boat. Holy cow. Look at that mark. I don't know what that is, but that's pretty big feeling. Ah, uh, he's wrapped up. That's what's going on. Look at that, he's lassoed. Is he even hooked? Yeah, yeah, the bait's in his mouth. Wow, how do you do that? I'm impressed with myself. No wonder he came in like that way. There he goes. He's off. Oh, he's mad too. He's like, what the heck? What the heck, guys? A big head. Big headed male. Cool. I'm just gonna grip this guy. I guess his mouth is wide open. Oh, that hook's gonna pop out too. Oh, he's barely rat or hooked. A couple good spins and he's gonna be gone. Oh god, I should have netted him. Got him. I don't know how that didn't come out. Here. Oh, well, we got another one. All right. Another blue cat. Glad I didn't turn the camera. You guys wouldn't have seen that. 
will turn it just a little bit now though all right this is how the action is going to be with the blue catch just only catch doubles he's almost not a double because i was uh if i would have netted him it wouldn't have been a double oh no get out of that line come on you can do it i got an upriver wind and there's almost no flow like they completely lie with the generation no, I know it says subject to change, but man, there's just nothing going right now. And that wind's blowing up against it. It just kind of sucks for anchoring. This guy might be about the same same size. Scoach smaller. Got out of that line. Sweet. It's all right. Not a bad double. There's some structure behind me. Uh, like it looks like a big rock. And uh, it's just kind of like a more of a jagged bottom than a lot of the area around here. And I don't typically think of blue cats as rock fish, like fishing around rocks, but that's just mainly because Potomac doesn't have much rock. So it does seem like they some of these fish get clustered around it. <sighs> All right, solid double. Solid. I'll take that. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> <Ha! laughs> I'm fighting with those other fish, getting them un undone, and this one went down. They are hiding out behind that rock. There was a lot of bait fish on it, too. But, uh, wow, this guy's all over the place. But uh, I guess there are some big fish in there with them. Bigger fish. <laughs> this guy's feisty. I don't think he's got a lot of weight to back up his energy, but he's a feisty fish. Probably like that second one I just got. Second of the double. Can't complain when they hold their own. All right. He might have a little bit of weight to him. Yeah. Yeah, all right, he's digging. When he does his shakes, he doesn't feel big, but when he when he starts digging down, he does. He feels like he's got a little bit of weight. We're going to see him soon here. I think. Look at him go. Yeah, he's the biggest of the three. Yeah, he's a... He's a 20 probably. He's a netter. All right. Wow, this spot is paying off. I should have came up here. I was just trying to do different things. I didn't want to just do the same thing again. You know, I was in the last video I put out from here. I fished in this area and I try to do different things, switch it up for you guys. But sometimes you got to go where where it works. Oh yeah. Three out of my six rods are out of commission. That's a good thing to have. Good situation to be in here. Woo! Let's get you out of the net before another one folds over. Almost a triple. Not quite. They don't want to be friends, it looks like. Okay, look, this one's going down now. Jeez. <sighs> Woohoo. You guys see that take down? I think you did. Huh. What a spot. I did put new baits on some of these, but this is an old bait, I believe. It's another decent fish. Definitely no channel cat. You're gonna have four blues in the boat. Look at that. That one's biting. Man, they're in here. It sucks because there's a lot of road noise, and I, like I said, I fished this recently, and. and 
maybe the last video or the last video from here but it's hard to go away from spots that work there's this section of the river doesn't have that many spots to go to to be honest a lot of it's shallow all right he's digging now too <laughs> this is fun this is a lot of fun here and i'll get a phone call my wife checking in on me yeah another porker a big male Maybe these guys in here are keeping the channel cats away. <sighs> Got him. <sighs> yeah, he might be the second biggest in this group. Hot action on a cold river. Woo! It's kind of a cheesy line but i might use it gotta get some lines back in the water here look at this mess of fish guys that's that's some they're all quality fish for this river for any river i mean that's just good fishing i'm happy <sighs> is i think the first fish i got because i put the gripper in his mouth maybe that was a second you guys can figure that out but he was 15 so that's pretty cool get him back there it goes I'll get the littlest guy i think that was the second one anyhow if you guys are like that rod in the back bouncing sucks cast it out I, it's getting me too don't worry all right this is the smallest of them all i didn't weigh him but he's probably about 13 pounds or so pretty cool yeah it keeps getting me and i know it's dangling but uh, i'm gonna get some weights on these guys now all right the second biggest right at 20 pounds big head he's rolling on me it's hard to show him off but big headed male i think and the other one's probably 23 24 I'll, I'll get a quick weight on it this guy's bleeding yeah. all right all right i get it you want to go well these fish are definitely hardy all right 25 pounder that is a good fish anywhere you go but especially on this river i say it a lot they don't get that big down here um they haven't been in this river as long as some of the others like the james or the P potomac or the rap but uh they're getting big quick and this is a fine specimen from out of here Whew. what a dreary nasty day but these fish are making it worthwhile cool yeah guys yeah and they all burped out quite a bit there uh they all swam away no problem i think i'm gonna get this fish here oh yeah yeah <laughs> now this guy is rolling not a channel from what i can tell but another decent blue cat another one i'm happy to catch here <laughs> tell you what it's been kind of a slow day two real fish before this uh mess and you know a couple channel cats mixed in that I, don't, I doubt you guys really saw much of and uh now bam just like this craziness it's probably like quarter after 10 something like that my wife called i still haven't been able to call her back she probably thinks i'm in the river somewhere hopefully the audio is all right i know the bridge is loud but hopefully it's, it's raining it, it can screw up the speakers i hope everything's working another decent fish yeah yeah tell you what when it's on it's on 
I gotta get my kids here sometime. Uh, you know, uh, he's keeping his mouth open. I think I'm gonna grip this one. Oh man, it's not much of a hook job. Hopefully you guys gotta see him because he's probably gonna fall off. Really either gotta sharpen these points or switch out the hooks. They're getting kind of dull. I'm getting a lot of not the greatest hook sets lately. But to be fair, they've been used a lot. Look at that, right out. Woo! I'm not gonna weigh this one. I'm gonna guess 16 or 17. Big old freaking head. Listen to him burp out. Man, these fish are on fire right now. They are absolutely crazy. So I'm gonna get stuff figured out here. Something just beeped. And uh, get reset up. Oh my God, look at this. Look at this, I'm still holding this fish and there it goes. All right, get out of the boat, buddy. I got something big fighting. Yeah, this is nuts. This is absolutely nuts. So you noticed I did manage to cast a couple lines back in the water. The ones that had um, baits on it, I cast back in the water. And this one's already getting hit. I think this had one of the bigger fish on it. He's in that line. That's okay. It's bound to happen, especially in chaos like this. That word gets thrown around a lot, but this is this is chaos, and this is the right kind of chaos. Can't complain about this. <laughs> Man, I might just hunker down this spot till uh, it's time to go. I, I'm really not planning on staying super late today. It's dreary. I want to get home, work on some stuff at the house hang out with the family but uh man these fish are gonna make it hard to do that he pulled up that other line crap i gotta net this one that's another good porker of a fish like catching porky pigs out here come here luckily he kind of kind of gave up once he got wrapped remember that time i tried to get a fish and fell in the river that's a that's another 20 plus pounder yeah big boy it's like a whole school of these monsters in here the monsters is a little bit of a exaggeration but that's some good fish i hope this this other line doesn't get bit because that's gonna be a that's gonna be bad this thing is a jerk Knocked my extinguisher off, sliming up my boat. All I did was catch it. I don't know what the big deal is here. I put a hook through its mouth. This might be starting to get repetitive here, but yeah. Oh, what a jerk. 24 pounder in that flurry of catfishing, man. That is that is the best kind of fishing out there. Yeah, it'd be nice to have them spread out a little bit more, but cannot complain with that action. Not at all. Yeah, that was for the thumbnail. All right, guys, I got to get recombobulated. I got to call my wife back. Let go. And they're all swimming away nice and healthy. Neato. <laughs> What else can you say? Cool. Had just enough break to call my wife and get things resituated. I was trying to figure out my anchor because it's all messed up i was sitting really ugly and uh i got it kind of situated here and was fixing a line or two and this one started going as you saw like i said i really hope i have audio right now uh this speaker isn't a waterproof speaker and it's raining or microphone uh, it's just like a slight drizzle here so i don't know what it's doing hopefully you guys can hear me
Yeah, another decent blue cat. I gotta tell you, I don't catch that many small blue cats. It's like either a channel cat or a good sized blue. This is a cool area. And there's flatheads in here too. It's just 40 degree water temps. I'm not gonna catch a flathead, even if I dangle in front of their face. That could be another 20. It's gonna be pushing it. Deserves the uh, the net. Oh man. You know, if I brought somebody here, I probably wouldn't catch a single fish. I don't know what what goes on with that. I always try to get people on fish and I always screw it up somehow. But when I go by myself, I end up having banger days. I don't know what it is. Oh yeah, that's well over 20. That's just a solid beefy fish. <laughs> Man, this is a heck of a day here. Hell of a day. I, I'm, I, I'm loving it. I didn't think I was going to with the weather that we're having. But how can you not like this? <laughs> I know they're not monsters. But they're not bad either. I can't complain about that. And the numbers, man. This spot is just crazy good. There's times where I come down here, I don't get a bite. Or I'll catch like two channel cats. And I'm learning it's, it's definitely flow related. Uh, still not that much flow here, but there's been times I've come down and there's just no water moving and I, I did not do well. Uh, I guess they have generated. Maybe they're they're taking a break with their units. I don't know. They're supposed to be running 37,000 cubic feet pretty much all day long, and they're definitely not doing that. But oh well, we got fish. I'm gonna recast, get cleaned up, and see if we can't get some more. All right, so it's really died down, but the rain's picked up, and uh, I don't know. I haven't had a bite in a long time and i think i caught all the fish that are going to be here for a while i'm sure more will move in but i really only wanted to do a half day trip anyway and it is right at half a day so i'm going to pack it in i hope you guys really enjoyed this episode i really enjoyed making it that was a heck of a day uh especially with all that action all at once that was crazy and, I, and i'm i'm happy for it uh thanks for watching and i'm going to keep making these videos you know it's a not the best time of year for cat fishing you know i love flatheads but I couldn't get on this year, but the blues are playing They're really nice. And I'm going to keep catching them as long as I can. So until the next episode, thanks for watching.